Once you have an organization chart built on a slide, we can change its current layout for one of the other pre-built organizational chart layouts. So if we take our Italia organization chart large file, and on slide two, we have the organization chart. If you then select the organization chart, this then activates the smart art tools. On the design tab, we have a section here referred to as layout. And if you click the drop down arrow here, it shows you all the layouts for the organizational chart. Now, as you move through the options, you can see it apply it to the organization chart on the page. So I've hovered over the picture one, I get the picture one applied temporarily, or the title one, or the circular one, or the full circular one, the hierarchy drop shadow box, labeled hierarchy, table hierarchy, horizontal organization chart, Perhaps your organization chart looks better horizontally. Architecture layout, multi-level hierarchy, horizontal hierarchy, labeled hierarchy, hierarchy list, or plain text hierarchy. So not actually clicking doesn't apply any of these formats, just moving through, you can see which one will fit the bill you're after really. If I change to the picture organization chart, what I then have is a little box to allow me to add a picture. All I do is click, choose a picture from my system and insert, and I'm now a koala. Same for Jane, she can become a penguin, and James over here can become a jellyfish. So that can be quite useful if you do have pictures of everybody who's in your organization. So to change the layout, you come to the layout section up here on the design tab, click the drop down and choose the layout that matches what you're after. Now you can change the layout of parts of an organization chart if it's going to get quite messy. For example, down here we have Mickey, Harry and Jill are what are called hanging below their boss, James Brown. And we can change that. If I choose James and come over to this section here where it says layout with a drop down arrow, this will only affect the current branch. I could go to standard and you can see the three people then appear underneath horizontally, or I can choose both, in which case they will hang out both sides of a vertical bar. Obviously, if there's only one, it can't hang out both sides. This works best if they're even, or I can say left hanging. So they all hang off the left hand side of the vertical bar or right hanging. So they'll hang off the right hand side of the vertical bar. So this layer will only affect the branch line that you currently are in. So I'm going to go both. So they hang out both sides. And if I choose guy, that will affect this branch level. And I could say both hang in there as well. And then everybody hangs out both sides, but because some of these people then have people relating to them, that can actually start to look quite messy. So I'm going to go back to layout and choose standard, which means everybody at that branch level so here appears horizontal. So we can change the layout effectively at a global level here for the whole organization chart or at branch level over here to decide whether that particular branch is laid out standard format or in a hanging format, either all on the left or on the right or hanging out both sides.